guys, today I will teach you how to use the time lapse mode on your GoPro Hero 4 Silver or Black Edition. Um, <clears throat> so what you want to start off with is you want to have the the newest update on your GoPro. To do that, you just go into your GoPro app, as I showed in, in another video, and um, it should come right up. And then you install it; it it's all aut automatically. Now, then once you're there, and you have your GoPro. Just press the on, bu on button once so the camera turns on. Okay, now as you can see right now, we're in the film mode. Now, um, we j we're just going to go through. Now we're in the photo mode, but we don't want that either. We want to go into there. Now, I think of stock, it's, it's in burst settings mode. But we want to go into time lapse mode. Now, to do that, <coughs> what you do is you press there. So you press, you press this button there, the settings button. Okay. Now you can see the screen there. So to change, so with this button you go through the menu. To change what's there, you press, you use the shut, the shutter button. Now, so we want to have time. So there's night lapse, burst, or time lapse. Choose time lapse there. And then just press the on slash mode button. Now here you can choose the interval of which the photos should be taken. So there's uh, 1 seconds, 2 seconds, 5 seconds, 10, 30, 60, and 0.5 seconds. You, wa you want to probably choose anything between 0.5 and 2 seconds. Although I'm going to go with 1 second because... I think 0.5 seconds is a bit too fast, and one second is just perfect. Now we're gonna go further down here. Now there, you choose um, what resolution you want your photo to be. So here, right now, we have the 12 megapixel wide selection. Then there's also 7 megapixels wide, 7 megapixels medium, 5 megapixels medium, and then again, we're at 12 megapixels wide. You probably want to leave that there. Now we go here. And now this is for exposing the shot correctly. Um, what if you have this turned on? What the GoPro will do is it will see whatever is in the is right in the middle of a shot and um, expose that properly. So not care about anything else that's on the outside. We probably don't. You probably don't want that. So just leave it up. And this is the Pro Tune, which you probably already know about. So when you once it when you're done, you uh, go to exit and press the shut shutter button. Although you can always just press the settings button again to exit so press the setting see and now we're back and now we have here the time lapse with the ultra, ultra wide now i don't have an nsd card inserted right now um... but i will show uh, i will show you some footage i will add in some footage for the video so if you enjoyed this video and if it helped you please um... like comment and subscribe and i'll see you all and i'll see you all in my next video Bye.